spacing is one of the most important measures undertaken in the lifestyle of a forest stand. The Young Forest Stage presents a unique opportunity to improve the development and quality of the forest. Well-executed spacing provides the right conditions for profitable thinning and protects against storm damage. For more than 50 years, work in our young forests has been dominated by traditional clearing saws. But the new backpack chainsaw can make spacing physically easier and more efficient. The backpack chainsaw is ergonomically designed to avoid placing an uneven strain on the body. The engine is placed at the back and fixed in a harness that distributes the majority of the weight to the hips. The frame supporting the drive shaft relieves stress on the shoulders when working which is important for making work easy. The backpack chainsaw is equipped with a chain and bar instead of a saw blade. Despite the chain, safety levels are high with the new saw. If the operator falls, the risk of he or she being injured by the chain is reduced, thanks to the frame design. The backpack chainsaw can be used for all types of spacing work, but is most effective in selective spacing that requires high precision. Precision is so high that exact cuts of spike knots and repairs to fork stems of remaining trees can be carried out at heights of up to 3 meters. Cutting with the backpack chainsaw is essentially free from kickback, thus minimizing the risk of hitting stones. The backpack chainsaw is especially suitable for spot clearing and spacing of low shelter wood. Spot clearing entails clearing away deciduous brushwood with a radius of about 50 centimeters of the plant, whilst leaving the rest. A few years later, a second cleaning is carried out until the final plantation is formed. The backpack chainsaw's design enables higher stump heights to be achieved. Stump heights can be varied with the aid of the flexible line supporting the drive shaft. When spacing operations are carried out in stages, the stump height should be selected so that the operator can step over these on the second cleaning. A higher stump does not create any direct problems itself and will rot and decompose with time. The backpack chainsaw is highly effective when spacing low shelter wood. After spacing, the deciduous wood functions partly as protection from frost for the spruce plants and also helps reduce the occurrence of stump sprouts. With its greater reach, the backpack chainsaw has an advantage and saves its operator many steps around the stand when spacing the same area. This is because the operator no longer needs to go right up to each stem before performing the cut, since the reach is about 2 meters both horizontally and vertically. It's also possible to cut thicker stems with greater precision than with a rotating saw blade. When cutting thicker stems, there's an accompanying push and pull hook to mount on the blade, which is used to push or pull the stem in the desired direction. Stems that have not been sufficiently spaced during their young forest stage may require clearing of undergrowth before mechanized thinning. Again, the backpack chainsaw's reach is an advantage, since it saves steps in the stand of trees. Suppressed trees and trees that have grown together are cut and pulled down easily with the help of the hook. When spacing in dense areas, high stems can be cut in sections, enabling them to fall easily to the side. Remember that the clearing of undergrowth must be carried out in time. That is to say, three to five years before thinning, thus allowing the stumps time to decompose before the thinning machine needs to make its way through the stand. The circular blade brush saw and the new backpack chainsaw are two methods that complement each other. New opportunities and a greater interest in spacing could be good byproducts of the new backpack chainsaw. Spacing does not have to be drudgery. If the job is simpler and less physically demanding, then it becomes fun to go out and take care of the young forests. 